My name is Daphne McDowell. I am the campus director of the Texas Preparatory School Austin. And we are so excited about our partnership with the Austin Revitalization Authority and Brian Joseph, who came to our campus to assist our students with completing a project for Black History Month. This project is centered around Cicely Tyson and Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. I can't wait to see the exhibition and uh, I'm very proud of all of the students who have participated and took a canvas home and decided that they would be a part of the project. Uh, thank you for, to the Austin Revitalization Authority and thank you Bidey Man for coming to our campus and including us in this fantastic project. My name is Elton Fight. I'm the uh, Operations Director for Texas Preparatory School Austin and Roots Austin, uh, located at 7540 Ed Bluestein Boulevard in Austin, Texas. Um, the Texas Preparatory School got its start here in Austin in 2013, and we've been doing the best that we can to serve the uh, Austin community. Recently, Mr. Bidey came through to uh, Roots Austin and Texas Preparatory School Austin uh, to do a project with our kids. Uh, the project uh, was an art uh, creation, uh, painting, drawing, sketch project in which the, the students got a chance to draw Martin Luther King Jr. and Ms. Uh, Cicely Tyson. Uh, very great honorable work uh, to be honoring those legends uh, in their own right and especially in their particular um, spaces. Um, MLK, of course, everybody knows, is a, a great civil, civil rights leader um, and the impact that his legacy uh, has had has been felt around the world uh, in regards to culture, diversity, uh, inclusion, uh, to be included in that. And then we know Miss Cicely Tyson as the, uh, the groundbreaking actor uh, that she is and the, uh, the, the groundwork that she laid for uh, young African American uh, young ladies uh, to get into the acting field. But outside of that as well, her humanitarian work and things that she's done uh, has definitely uh, helped to perpetuate greatness uh, among all cultures. We are partnering this year with the Texas Preparatory School. And this time, we've done this a little bit different. It's actually where you put on a workshop and work with the kid versus a, a curating artist. So how is that experience? Well, it was very exciting, I, I must say. I did workshop because they didn't have an art teacher at school because of the pandemic. And uh, I spoke to Ms. Dolly Magdolo, who is the director over there, and she decided the kids in Africa, our school program might be best to choose it to work with on this project. Well, they were very receptive because I had a strategy involved in getting them to get excited. I told them about uh, Martin Luther King and Cicely Tyson, and I associated Martin Luther King with peace and Cicely Tyson with love. So I divided the kids into two groups. Some would do paintings that inspire them with love, and some, the others would do paintings that inspire them with peace. Oh, that's great, that's great. Before we leave this, I really want to highlight two things. Is, and we're all highlighting Cicely Tyson and MLK. Mm -hmm. And one I want to make a point is that these, these are body of work of Margaret Erty, which uh, the late Margaret Erty, which is the former chair 
person for the uh, 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 Austin Revitalization Authority, Dr. Charles Erdy. And so this is becoming part of our collection as we continue to build our art collection in this community. That's great, and I'm glad that you uh, added to your collection the area and supporting black artists, period. That's, that's our goal, and, and, and I'm real proud of our partnership with Texas Preparatory School, and hope we can do other partnerships with the other schools like this. I'm sure there are more. I, I'm sure we'll continue to do so. But before we go any further, I want to show you two of the paintings. Talk about the inspiration with, I had with the kids. I have two paintings here that I, uh, I these are actually collaborations. This first one was a silhouette of a sitting Tyson that I created and I asked the kids to add anything they felt about love surrounding this um, silhouette of Cecilia Tyson. And they came up with all these ideas themselves. But the most exciting thing to me about this is the way they communicated with each other in producing the work. And you have two or three people working at the same time and they did a fantastic job. That's great. That's great. This That's other great. one in, um, I have here was the silhouette of Martin Luther King. And first one was just, they were actually drawing on the, the canvas. This time they painted. And this is their interpretation of peace. 